Hey guys, and welcome. My name is NG Paradox, and we're here to talk about the Mega Campaign. Now, you can probably tell by the fact of the length of this video and the fact that we're here in EU4 that this video is not going to be the best of news. Now, what has happened is obviously we took our game from Crusader Kings 2, we converted it to EU4, and I downloaded the mod to convert EU4 to Victoria 2. Now, Mind you, I have used this mod before. I've used it about sometime last year, many, 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 many months ago, and a few times before that. And in the past, I've been able to make CK2 games to E4 to Victoria 2. But it does seem to be that this newest version, at least, of the Victoria 2 converter cannot convert games from CK2. Um, I actually finished the E4 game we got here, our little world we have right here. I finished this actually about a week ago, and I've been trying to find a solution, an answer, a way to fix it, and I've just not been able to find one actually. And there has been no solution so far to be able to fix it, so we can convert it. It's been an extremely frustrating time. I mean, I, I can imagine for you guys, I, I have to apologize obviously to you guys about this situation, because obviously for you guys, you followed the series up to this point. You know, for me, I put a lot of time into this series. You know, it's been many episodes and many hours into this series and I've enjoyed the I've enjoyed the journey the story we've told the history we've told up to this point I thought was kind of interesting in its own way sometimes frustrating also in its own ways uh, it, uh, but you know it, it's kind of its own world it was really fun to see it grow and how it transpired the dynasties rise the empires fall it was really cool to see it so it's been extremely annoying the last week trying to try and fix it now there's potential chance it can be fixed. I'm going to keep looking for ways to fix it. And if they update the mod, I I'm assuming they'll update it so it can work with CK2. Because that's something that's usually been with the mod. And I think that's something a lot of people want to be able to do a mega campaign. So the fact that you can't currently right now kind of worries me. So I, I would assume that they will update it at some point. But I don't know when that's going to come out. That could be next week. It could be next month. It could be three months. I I don't know their usual schedule. I uh, you know I don't I don't I don't work with them, so I have no idea how often they will upgrade that mod. So we're gonna have to wait and see when that comes out. Now now until then, obviously, there's nothing I can do, and that means for you guys, this is basically on hold until we can fix it or until they update um, the mod. If you guys think you can fix it or you know how to fix it or you'd like a go at fixing it, um, pop onto my Discord. It'll be I'll put it in the description below, and I will just message on there saying, hey, I want to look at the save, and I'll send you the save. If you think you can help, then obviously, all power to you. But from what I can see, there's no answer to it from what I've been told. Um, I went on the forums, you know. When I first did this series, which was like a, you know, a month ago, I went on the forums, and there was nothing saying about CK2 not being able to work with it. It's only been kind of the last couple of pages I looked at the forums. Other people have been saying they've had problems as well. And the person then said, oh, well, that's because you convert from CK2. You can't do that in this current version of the mod. So we have a, yeah, we have a problem with that. So I'm going to have to wait and see. But until then, obviously, I I want to give something back to you guys. Because I feel as though, obviously, for you guys, you've stuck with the series until this point. This series got a good number of views from you guys. You stuck with it, just like the Shattered Legacy series in our Game of Thrones mod. Those two, you guys seem to really enjoy. And because you guys are stuck with this series, I want to make another series just for you guys. Something that you guys would prefer. So the idea would be is that until this save, until we can convert it, until the update comes out, until we can fix it, I will do another series until then. And even if we do get to fix or does get updated very soon, I will also continue that series alongside this one. So I'd love to know from you guys in the comment section below, what would you like to see as an alternative series for now? until we can get the update or well, hopefully they have to, I'm just hoping they do make it I'm assuming they will make it for CK2 as well you'd hope so um, but what do you guys have to see tell me in the comment section below and if you look in the comments and you see an idea that you like please like it that way I can get a better idea of obviously what the whole of you would like um, for example you know, a couple of examples I have maybe because we we're going to convert to Victoria 2 I could do a series just in Victoria 2 I could get the the New Nations mod, and we could play in Victoria 2, do a series in that. Um, I've been playing it on my streams recently. I've been doing quite nicely, actually. I've learned the mechanics now. So I think I could do a series on it, and we could have fun with that. 
And then, you know, actually go to Victoria 2 at least for now. Or maybe what we could do, because I've enjoyed doing this so much, doing this observation series, I think you guys have as well. What we could do is we could go back to CK2 and we could change the situation. Maybe we choose a different scenario, maybe we choose 1066. Or maybe we activate the Sunset Invasion. Or maybe we turn on Shattered Legacy and try from there and convert to EU4 and can you know do the same thing we've done with this one and do it again just with a different scenario, a different situation to allow different outcomes that could be completely different. Shad Legacy obviously would be very, very different. And then hopefully by the end of the time we get to EU4, maybe then the mod will be updated and we can convert both of them to Victoria 2 and do both of them as well. That could be an option. Or maybe we could do a Crusader Kings 2 mod. I know I've been looking at After the End quite a lot. I've never actually been able to play it yet, but I've looked at it quite a lot. Always wanted to play as a Mormon. That could be an option as well. But th those are just a few ideas I've been having that I think maybe you guys in particular might like. Just because of the situation of liking this one, a situation we're in. Um, but yeah. But please tell me in the comment section below what you would like to do and make sure you like those you like the sound of, okay? And I'll go look through, in a couple of days, I'll look through your comments, and I will choose a new series to go until, well, and after, hopefully, the mod has been updated. But all I can say is, sorry guys, there's nothing I can do, this is this is one of those things, you know, they always say, don't work with, you know, kids, animals, and mods, you know, that that's always the things, isn't it? So, we'll have to wait and see. Uh, I say, you might have noticed I've been spreading out the release of our... Crusader Kings 2 Shattered Legacy and actually the Mega Campaign. You may have noticed recently actually the they kinda of, I'm probably gonna spreading out the releases, so hopefully I might be able to fix it. I've been trying to even though they told me I couldn't, I've been trying to find other ways maybe to fix it, but I just couldn't find one. And so here we are. But guys, I've been NG. I hope you have a good day, a good morning, a good night, and uh, of course a good tomorrow. No matter where you are. And I hope to see you around soon. But yeah. <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna miss this story for now. Hopefully we'll return soon. Cause I I wanna find out what happens to our lovely nations. You know, the rise and falls. It'd be fun to see what happens next. But yeah. See you around. Bye. Sir.